Welcome to this short video titled, What is a Course Management System? Presented by Excelsior Education Consultants, Limited Liability Corporation. A course management system allows instructors to post content on the web without knowing HTML. It also utilizes a set of tools and allows instructors to use these tools which will allow the relatively easy creation of online content and serves as a framework for teaching and managing the course and interacting with students. There's three main functions of a CMS. One is to create authoring and publishing tools. The second is to create and allow the creation of a virtual community of online learners and teachers. And three, it is a platform for data management that can be utilized both by both students and teachers. Let's explore authoring and publishing tools a little more in detail. These tools allow the instructor to publish files to a section of the course management system for students to download or simply publish a list of hyperlinks that students can click through to read additional materials online. Remember, this is all done without needing the knowledge of HTML. A second advantage uh, in the authoring and publishing tools functionality is that these tools facilitate the creation and publication of web, web pages, typically using templates. Also, audio or video streams may be accessed through the CMS, usually by means of a hyperlink. Probably one of the most common ways this is accomplished is by embedding code from YouTube into the content page, which allows the student to play a YouTube video right in the course. Also, every CMS enables instructors and students individually and as a group to communicate online. Can this communication online can be synchronous, which is uh, real time, and synchronous communication would be things like uh, a chat room where we're all meeting at the same time, or this communication can be a asynchronous, such as in a threaded discussion where students participate at their convenience. Other means of asynchronous communication in an online course could be through the use of a wiki, a blog, or a journal. Many courses online are conducted in an asynchronous fashion. And then finally, the data management area. A CMS offers the ability to capture students' performance on tests and their resulting grades. Also, this grading functionality usually includes the ability to enter grades for papers, projects, or tests not done online. Finally, the grading functionality also enables teachers to compute weighted averages of the students' grades throughout the semester to generate a final grade. Short summary of CMS. An online framework to facilitate three sets of interactions between teacher and student, between student and the content, and between the students themselves. This time, I would like to take the opportunity to thank you for viewing this video. I hope it was informative, and I hope you continue to uh, come back for the videos presented by Excelsior Education.